This is It's My Life 365, and today we're headed to a Bomi Benin. I'm travel writer, photographer Brendan Vanson, and this is my daily adventure. Welcome to It's My Life 365. So after wandering around yesterday and uh, checking out Cotonou a little bit, I decided I was just gonna bail. I'm gonna head up to Abome. I looked at my schedule also yesterday and realized I was supposed to be in the middle of Nigeria already. So <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous about this schedule and I've gotta get going. So the original plan was to get to Abome, spend two nights, and then cross the border to Nigeria. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave early this morning. It's only uh, about seven in the morning and head up there and try to check out this palace, an old fort that's up there from the from the old kingdom that used to rule these parts, and then uh, and then cross to Nigeria tomorrow morning. So we'll see how that plan goes, and yeah, let's hit the road. So I've arrived in the city of Abome, which is actually a really important city historically. This was basically the, the center of the Dahomey Empire that used to roam around these parts. And they had a large part in the slave trade. And before that, they were very, very powerful, very brutal people. The French were absolutely terrified of them. But then again, who aren't the French afraid of? I just smashed down some lunch and uh, now I'm going to head to the museum which is housed in the old palace. That was very interesting. I wish I could film more in places like that, but cameras are never allowed. I snuck a couple pics, but uh, that's about it. Um, absolutely brutal history, really rough. For example, the person's job, who it is to cut other people's heads off. He has one chop and one chop only. If he doesn't get them clean in one chop, they chop off his head. It's really brutal. And for example, when the king died, um, he was supposed to die with all his wives and he had 200 of them. So instead they selected 41, poisoned 41 of his wives and buried them with him. So absolutely brutal. They were a very uh, powerful kingdom, but very, very brutal. They showed no mercy. And uh, yeah, you can kind of see why the French were scared of them. I'll give a French a pass on this one. Anyways, I'm done for today. I'm headed into uh, my hotel for the evening. Uh, maybe get some food and a drink. So I'm gonna call it a night tonight because tomorrow I'm headed to Nigeria. Shit's about to get real and it's my life 365. And I hope you stick with me tomorrow. I'll see you then.